joined by victorious captain of the third place of Team Spirit, Nicola Carey, alongside Centurion Sophia Dunkley and Shia Moogle. Nick, congrats on the win. You must feel bloody good right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, look, it was an incredible game um, for you know D Dot and Laura to come out about how they did and, and post 180. Um, it was a pretty big score. Um, and then for Dunks to then move up top of the order, come out um, and sort of match that and I guess one up it a little bit there. Um, to chase that down in 20 overs was an unbelievable effort. And, um, yeah, it was really nice to finish on the high. Were you worried at the end of the innings by the total they posted? Oh, look, it was pretty large, but um, it was a really good batting week and I feel like there's been a fair few runs out there in, in most of the game. So, look, it was a large total, I won't lie, but um, yeah, we, we knew we had to come out with a lot of intent, which is exactly what Dunks does every time she goes out and bats. And, um, yeah, to peel off 100 like you did, it was, yeah, it was an amazing inning. So, um, yeah, really impressive to chase that down. Yeah, Dunks, she casually says peel off 100. That was a match-winning <laughs> performance to earn a third place. Did it all just click for you today? Yeah, I think obviously they got a really big total um, and Dot and batted really well. So it was just a case of going out there and showing some intent and trying to keep up with the rate, I think. So yeah, just go out there and be positive. So try to pick up for one, really. Just go out and outshine the Dot in Century. <laughs> with the Dot in Century. <laughs> Not quite. I think it's just, <laughs> it's just good to get the win, I think, and end on a high. Like We've had such a great journey together as a group and I think we've got really close. So um, yeah, to go out on a high today is really special and then we can celebrate that tonight. Um, and also, you've been bowling a lot in this tournament, which we'd love to see. How much are you enjoying doing that as well? Yeah, I've yeah. loved it really. I've you know, come back with a new run up, I'm a different bowler now. <laughs> I've bowled for like, I don't know, a year and a half, two years in like regional cricket and stuff. So, yeah, it's good to get bowling here and hopefully this year to be able to come back for the next bit. And Shire, obviously, you've been playing in your home country on a side that's now just come third in the tournament. What does it mean to you to have been part of this team? Well, to be a part of such a big tournament it itself is a big thing for me, you know, it's like, and then ending it on a winning note, I mean, whether it's a third place or second or first, it doesn't really matter. But the thing is, like, the recognition that we all are getting, it's something beyond explanations. I'm really, really happy to be a part of it and uh, really looking forward for many more, many more such tournaments, yeah. And you've not just been part of it, you've been taking wickets, you've been stemming the flow of runs, so you've really played your part in this team as a whole. Have you found that you've learned loads throughout this Oh yes, if I talk about learning, it has been tremendous. I mean, if we uh, look at today's situation, well, that, that sort of like, if we are put in that situation, it would have been totally different. But then uh, how these people, you know, they've taken it up, like whatever thing we tell them before, and they continue to do that inside. It's something, you know, that, that mental stability is something that I've learned a lot. And I'm sure that I will impart this knowledge to my teammates as well. And talking of mental stability, you've taken on the role as captain this t this tournament, Nick. Um, how much have you enjoyed that? Oh, look, it's actually been a lot of fun. Um, I was obviously quite stressed at the start of the tournament um, when I got given the captaincy, but it's been really fun. Like, the group's been amazing. I've had a lot of help from, um, you know, Dunk, so if, like, some senior players have been really helpful there. So um, I feel like I've warmed to the role, but, um, yeah, look, I'm happy just to leave the captaincy at the fair break tournament um, and go back to just being a, a player after this. <laughs> And um, so what's it been like to have Nick as captain? Oh, it's been great. I think obviously start off a bit sceptical and a bit late, but I think she's taken to the role, <laughs> <laughs> taken to the role great and, and managed the team really well. Let me top the group, so what more can you say about that? And um, where does this century sit for you in long in the memory? Is it your first T20 century? I think, yeah, it'll be the first T20 century. So yeah, it's definitely a memory I have for forever, I guess. Um, and it was just nice to go out there. That with Bricey, that with Nick at the end, who hit a few lovely bombs. Um, and yeah, so yeah, it's a good, great day. What a day.